A shadow fell upon the life of Robert Louis Stevenson, the celebrated Scottish poet. The insidious disease, tuberculosis, began to gnaw at his strength, leaving him a prisoner in his own body. His right hand, the instrument that had birthed countless tales and poems, grew weak, its once deft movements failing him. The pen, once an extension of his very soul, lay useless in his grasp. Despair threatened to engulf him, but Robert, a man of indomitable spirit, refused to surrender. With a determination that mirrored the heroes he penned, he set about mastering a new skill. Laboriously, he began to write with his left hand. It was a clumsy dance. The letters shaky and uneven, yet they were a testament to his unyielding spirit. For a few precious days, the ink flowed again. Each word of victory against the debilitating foe. But fate, it seemed, held one more cruel twist in store. The relentless disease tightened its grip, sapping the strength from his left hand as well. The pen once more slipped from his grasp, leaving him trapped in a silent world. Yet, even in the face of this crushing adversity, Robert refused to let the fire within him die. He turned to his loyal friend, his eyes conveying a plea beyond words. With the help of this devoted companion, his literary works continued to take shape. Unable to speak, Robert devised a system of communication, his fingers forming words in the silent language of signs. Then, even speech was stolen from him. The malignant disease ravaged his tongue, leaving him utterly voiceless. Yet, within the darkness, Robert found a spark of defiance. He began to tap out verses on a surface, his fingers spelling out words, one by one. It was a slow, laborious process, each poem a testament to his remarkable fortitude. The world may have silenced Robert Louis Stevenson, but it could not silence the spirit of a storyteller. Though robbed of movement and speech, he continued to weave his magic. His journey became an inspiration, a testament to the indomitable human spirit that could create beauty even amidst immense suffering. His story echoed the tales he wrote, filled with heroes who triumphed over adversity, reminding everyone that the flame of creativity flickers brightest in the face of darkness.